Aisha's back, baby! I'm After so sorry. After the second video of refurbishing the office downstairs. Mm. I regret everything. Yes, yes, the people, it's happening. Office renovations, part two. Here we go. First of all, we're getting rid of this calf to the fireplace that is no mass. We are plugging in both entrances to this former pipe, whatever this is. And we are going to fill up the middle with concrete, bring it at the same level. Then we're gonna do the walls, man, the bottom of the walls. We're gonna try and bring all of this to the same level. We're gonna do a bit more plaster because I have plenty of and maybe a bit of cement we're gonna do the walls but then we're gonna put some self leveler all over the floor and then we're gonna start building the hardwood floor on top of a finished subfloor let's get to work with number uno this guy That's fine. This, however, is hardcore, so this is gonna be the big problem. Almost about an hour into it, it is going slow. So, um, back to the neighbors. Let's see if they have something with a, you know, like a big boy breaker or something. Big boy thing now. Titan, sponsor me. Boys and girls, it is done with the beast. Gucci, now we fill it back up. So while hoovering the floor to take all the dust and crap, I'm seeing all these old holes now that I've hoovered it. And these are screw and plug holes, which means there was a previous floor very well designed, stable. Oh my god, it's so dusty in here. And they took that out and replaced it with whatever the f this is. Anyway, yo, it's back to work. It's that we fill up some holes with a cement. Came out a little bit thin, because obviously I don't know how to mix these. It's much better than the first attempt, which is this water. Essentially, I've made too much. <laughs> but that's okay, because there's a lot to fill in. Try to level the entire floor once we clean up and get rid of most of the scrap. Remember to prime kids, it saves your walls. Didn't work, not this time. But I'll fix it. Well, 
Whoa. I just cannot get around to finishing one full bucket. So every time I do this, I waste a bit, which is annoying. But this piece of wood, this is a nice thing. Right fam, new plan. We're gonna make our life considerably easier when putting this plaster at the bottom. Here's what I came up with. Best thing I've learned is to be frugal because you can find loads of stuff for free. Well, I did the math. Every time I took something from here, every time I did something like this, I've already saved over a thousand pounds in a month. You can save in plenty of places. You just gotta be a little bit creative with it. We're gonna use all of that free leftover stuff to make our life easy. You know what, it's just gonna be easier. Here's why, because we can splash onto it and from there push into the wall with little to no spillage on the floor. happening yo I have put this off for months but it's finally happening well we are sanding it so I'm gonna get the big boys out just like I did with the floors except this time I'm not gonna mess up the wood
to I Hate This Room, part three. Aisha's sanding the downstairs decoration that we did because we thought we could do better, she thought we could do it better, so she's on that. Meanwhile, I'm returning to the cursed the room that is the downstairs office was. February 2023 and it's still not done but for this video at least part two is a wrap we have successfully mounted a good amount of floor joists we actually used the original ones Aisha's coming in because she's curious what I'm doing hello boo but for now trust me it's good Aisha did a dope job in leveling with me we even put this black tar sort of paint called blackjack on the ground over the self-leveler to seal it even further against damp because clearly this room had damping issues because of that whatever the f pipe here that we discovered in the first video which I left you a link in the description to go see if you have one. So anyway, this is all for this video. Thanks for watching and thanks for your support. If you've not followed me on YouTube for a while, that's because I've been up to a new series called The UK Stole It and I'm trying something new. But this house vlog, first house renovation vlog, will continue. Subscribe if you haven't done so already and press that bell thing to get the notifications when I upload something. Thanks for watching this. As always, follow me on the social medias where I'm trying to post a lot more reels and they seem to be generating good engagement. So I'm hoping you get to have access to some new kind of content from Either way, go check it out. Give your boy a like and a follow. It means a lot to me. Ah. I'll see you in the next video. Later!